لازم نہیں کہ خضر کی ہم پیروی کریں مانا کہ ایک بزرگ ہمیں ہم سفر ملے ہائی ویلکم ٹو انادر ایپیسوڈ آف ایوری ڈے غالب ویئر وی یوز دا پوئٹری آف دا فیمس نائنٹین سینچری پوئٹ مرزا غالب ٹو ریفلیکٹ آن آور اون ٹائمس ٹو ڈیز ورس وچ ویو ٹائٹل آن تھنکنگ فار ون سیلف گو سم تھنگ لائک دس لازم نہیں کہ خضر کی ہم پیروی کریں لازم نہیں کہ خضر کی ہم پیروی کریں مانا کہ ایک بزرگ ہمیں ہم سفر ملے مانا کہ ایک بزرگ ہمیں ہم سفر ملے ٹرانسلیٹڈ اٹ از ناٹ نیسیسری دیٹ وی فالو ان دا فٹ اسٹیپس آف خضر وی ول جسٹ تھنک دیٹ وی فاؤنڈ این اولڈ جینٹل مین ایز این اکمپنیمنٹ آن آور جرنی ایز اے فرینڈ ہو کمس الانگ وتھ اس آن آور جرنی اے ہم سفر واٹ از ہی ٹرائنگ ٹو سی ہیئر ایز ویو سین ان پاسٹ ایپیسوڈس غالب ٹیکس ویری ویل نون ٹروپس and uh, people, characters from the Qur'an and from other places in the tradition and uses them to make his point. Khizr is the key character in this verse. Hazrat Khizr is a person who is supposed to guide those who are lost. That's what he stands for in this kind of poetry. So what is he saying? Lazim nahi ke khizr ki hum pairavi kare. It's not necessary that we have to follow this person. This person whose job is to show the way to those who are lost, Ghalib is saying, it's all right, you know, let's not take him that seriously. We'll think of him as an hamsafar. Mana ki ek buzurg hame hamsafar mile. There's an old gentleman here. We're going to go with him on our journey. Right. Now, uh, why have we titled it on thinking for oneself? Hopefully, the meaning makes it clear. that he is taking a figure who is supposed to be followed right and then saying well really but you should be thinking for yourself where do you want to go you will find lots of people along the way to help you there now let's connect it a little bit to our times and in the book we have taken a couple of examples because um we are economists our brain naturally goes to what should society do what model of development should be followed what should be our path in the future and there are many models out there so to speak there are rich countries who want the developing countries to behave in a certain way to develop in a certain way but from alib we learn that we have to think for ourselves as a society what should our future be what should our society look like it doesn't have to be modeled on something that exists somewhere we can take an inspiration from many places kafi buzurg hain دنیا میں جن کو ہم ہم سفر مان سکتے ہیں کہ ہمارے ساتھ چلیے ہم کو بتائیے کیا کرنا ہے ٹیل اس واٹ ٹو ڈو بٹ وی آر ناٹ گوئنگ ٹو امیٹیٹ یو ہم آپ کی پیروی نہیں کریں گے وی آر گوئنگ ٹو تھنک فار آور سیلس اینڈ آئی ایم شیور یو کین تھنک آف مینی مور ویز آف ایکسٹینڈنگ دس تھاٹ ان یور پرسنل لائف فار انڈیا ایز اے سوسائٹی اینڈ سو آن سو انجم اینڈ مائی پرپز یور از ٹو سیٹ یو تھنکنگ الانگ دس روڈ Before I leave you with this thought, I thought I'll also let you know a little bit about where do these verses come from. Usually we only take one couplet, but as many of you know, couplets come in usually in a ghazal. So there is a bunch of couplets that have the same rhyme scheme and so on, that belong together in a way. This particular couplet that we talked about today comes from a famous ghazal of Ghalib, Taskeen ko hum na roe. That's the first line of the uh, ghazal. You can Google it. And uh, there's a very funny uh, ending verse to this ghazal that I'll leave you with. That doesn't really pertain to the uh, discussion that I was just having. But it's, a, it's a, an interesting verse to think about. So he ends, Ghalib ends this, this particular ghazal with the verse, Ay saakina ne kuchay dildar dekhna. Ay saakina ne kuchay dildar dekhna. تم کو کہیں جو غالب آشف تسر ملے ہوپ فلی ول ریکگنائز دا کامن رائمنگ وتھ دا ورس دیٹ وی ڈسکسڈ دس از جسٹ اے فن ورس دیٹ از ٹاکنگ ٹو دا ریزیڈنٹس آف دا بلو اٹس لین مینی آف دا لوورس ہینگ آؤٹ ان دا بلو اٹس لین اینڈ دیٹس ویئر دے لو سو غالب از سینگ ٹو دیم 
oh you who are always hanging out there watch out you might also spot ghalib there one day ghalib e ashuf tasar meaning somebody who has been breaking his head against the wall in despair maybe you will see him wandering around somewhere i'll leave you with that fun thought and i'll see you next time when we speak about how ghalib thinks about experimentation see you next time